Now, Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. The temperatures, they haven't been too bad to need those coats just yet, but that's more than likely going to change by the end of the month as uh, October, one of the months with the most rapid decline in uh, normal temperatures. Let's take a look at the forecast this evening, though. Not bad at all. 75 at 7 o'clock with 69 degrees at 9 p.m. And we'll be looking for uh, partly to mostly sunny sky for a little while, but clouds increasing later this evening and overnight and 67 at 11. And then those clouds roll in tonight. There's even a slight change chance of a late night shower, but the best chance of rain next 24 hours. That'll come up tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow evening. 61 at 8 o'clock, mostly cloudy. Maybe a, a few peaks of sunshine at noon, 73. And then a better chance of some of those showers again uh, later in the day. So more clouds return later tonight. We'll have that shower chance in our weather headlines. Better rain chances coming our way for Wednesday afternoon. And then showers are likely for Thursday and Friday. Maybe even a little thunder and lightning thrown in there. Uh, lower chances of rain, though, as we get to the weekend. Right now, the weekend looks mostly dry. Lows tonight, upper 50s to about 60 north. Some clouds moving up from the south. Low 60 south, Oxford 61, Springboro 62, Wilmington 62, about 60 degrees here in Dayton, Xenia, Eaton. And then high temperatures tomorrow afternoon. You'll notice the mid to upper 70s covering the region, maybe as warm as uh, 79 at Bell Fountain, but may actually be a little cooler southwest where the clouds and the rain come in earlier. Uh, 76 around Richmond, Eaton, Oxford. Still the upper 70s here in the Dayton area before the rain begins. And then it looks like mostly in the low to mid 70s around the area on Thursday. But warm air is going to be moving out of the Plain States as we go through the week. So you can see some of that surging uh, into the Mississippi and Ohio River Valleys as we get to Saturday. So upper 70s expected here. We could even be up around 80 degrees for Sunday afternoon in that warm air as it moves into the even the lower Great Lakes and the Ohio Valley. Uh, clouds thinning out a little bit tonight, partly cloudy skies, but still some clouds to the south of us will be advancing in later on this evening and things pretty quiet out there on live Doppler 2 HD. Occasionally we've had some blips on the radar and maybe a couple of sprinkles or a couple of raindrops falling out of those clouds, but things have been pretty quiet. But some high and mid-level clouds spreading up from the south now towards Cincinnati, and those will advance northward into the area tonight. Right now it's 78, east wind 8 miles per hour. Dew point in the upper 50s, 50% 50 the relative humidity. Everybody uh, pretty much in the 70s now, although Bell Fountain at 80 degrees, but 77 Urbana, Troy, Greenville, 75 Eaton and Richmond. Uh, so uh, not a bad evening on the way, but those clouds increasing later this evening overnight, even a slight chance of some showers. But as I mentioned, a better chance of showers showing up as we get to Wednesday afternoon. Here's your forecast tonight. Mostly cloudy and mild, maybe an isolated late night shower down to 60 degrees. Mostly cloudy tomorrow, mainly showers in the afternoon with a high temperature of 78. 63 at 9 o'clock, 73 at noon. Upper 70s, 3 p.m., but dropping back to 74 at 6 o'clock. Thursday's high, 72. Showers likely. Showers likely Friday, 75. And then nice weather for the weekend. Upper 70s Saturday, low 80s Sunday. Rain chances come up again late Monday and a little cooler by Tuesday.